Interesting Facts About the Temple of Karnak at Luxor 1. The Temple of Karnak, located in Luxor, Egypt, is one of the largest temple complexes in the world. 2. It is part of the Karnak Temple Complex, which includes a vast array of temples, chapels, pylons, and other structures dedicated to different deities. 3. Construction on the Temple of Karnak began around 2055 BCE during the Middle Kingdom and continued for over a millennium, with various pharaohs contributing to its expansion and embellishment. 4. The main deity worshipped at Karnak was Ammonius, the king of the gods in ancient Egyptian religion. 5. The name Karnak is thought to be derived from the Arabic word Al-Karnak, meaning fortified village. 6. The Temple of Karnak covers an area of about 200 acres, making it larger than some ancient cities. 7. The complex was a place of pilgrimage for ancient Egyptians and served as a center for religious ceremonies, festivals, and rituals. 8. The Hypostyle Hall in the Temple of Karnak is one of its most impressive features, with 134 massive columns arranged in 16 rows. 9. The Hypostyle Hall is 54,000 square feet, 5,000 square meters, in size, and its columns reach a height of 82 feet, 25 meters. 10. The Festival Hall of Tuthmosis III, also known as the Agmenu, is another notable structure in the Temple of Karnak, celebrating the said festival of the Pharaoh. 11. The Temple of Karnak contains several obelisks, including the tallest surviving ancient Egyptian obelisk, which was erected by Queen Hatshepsut. 12. The obelisks were often carved from single pieces of red granite and dedicated to various deities. 13. The Sacred Lake, an artificial lake within the complex, was used for ritual purification and is surrounded by various chapels and shrines. 14. The Temple of Karnak was connected to the Luxor Temple by an avenue of sphinxes, creating a ceremonial processional route. 15. The construction of the Temple of Karnak was a collaborative effort involving many pharaohs, including Hatshepsut, Amenhotep III, Seti I, Ramses II, and others. 16. The complex also served as a symbolic representation of the unity and continuity of the Egyptian state and religion. 17. The Avenue of Sphinxes connecting Karnak and Luxor was expanded by Amenhotep III and later modified by Ramses II. 18. The Karnak Temple Complex is known for its massive entry pylons, with impressive reliefs and colossal statues depicting pharaohs and gods. 19. The complex suffered damage over the centuries due to natural disasters, including floods and earthquakes, and was also subjected to some intentional destruction by later rulers. 20. The construction of the Karnak Temple Complex involved the use of various materials, including sandstone, limestone, and granite. 21. The Karnak Temple Complex was abandoned in ancient times, and portions of it became buried beneath the sands until its rediscovery in modern times. 22. The Opet Festival, an annual celebration honoring the god Ammonius, was held at the Karnak Temple Complex, involving processions and rituals. 23. The precinct of Ammonius Re, the central area within the Karnak Temple Complex, contains the main temples dedicated to Ammonius Re, Mut, and Kansu. 24. The complex underwent restoration and conservation efforts in modern times, with ongoing work to preserve its structures and reliefs. 25. The Karnak Temple Complex became a UNESCO World Heritage Site in 1979, recognizing its cultural and historical significance. 26. The open-air museum within the Karnak Temple Complex houses a collection of statues, sphinxes, and architectural elements from various periods. 27. The Karnak Temple Complex was a significant pilgrimage site for ancient Egyptians, drawing worshippers from all over the country.